Welcome to our new series of training videos in which we'll learn all the tips and tricks related to a Cronus Data Cloud plugin for ConnectWise Automate. In this video, we will show you a step-by-step -step how a managed service provider can install and configure the plugin, whereas in the next video, we will demonstrate for you how a managed service provider can manage the Acronis backup and recovery operations directly from the ConnectWise Automate user interface. So let's get started. Acronis Data Cloud is an innovative platform targeted at managed service providers, telcos, and resellers who would like to provide their customers with high quality backup, disaster recovery, and secure file sync and share and other data protection services. In turn, ConnectWise Automate is a cloud-based IT automation solution that helps service providers track and manage all IT assets of their customers scattered all over the world from one single location. It offers a balanced set of content management, remote monitoring, network administration, and troubleshooting tools. The Acronis Data Cloud and ConnectWise Automate are natively integrated with each other by means of the Acronis Data Cloud plugin. It allows providing and managing all the Acronis backup and recovery operations directly from the ConnectWise Automate user interface. Let's imagine a managed service provider who has been using ConnectWise Automate and wants to further differentiate themselves in the market by providing high quality data protection services for their customers. Therefore, they select Acronis Data Cloud as one of the easiest and most secure data protection solutions available in the market. Before installing the plugin itself, you need to purchase a subscription license for the Acronis Data Cloud from Acronis. It should be noted that the prices for the Acronis Data Cloud are very affordable even for small or novice service providers, whereas the advantages outweigh the costs. Along with the license, you will get a link, a username, and a password for the so-called Acronis Data Cloud Management Console. This is a sophisticated web-based tool that you can use to trace and manage all of your backup and recovery operations. As regards the system requirements, the Acronis plugin can be installed on any ConnectWise Automate server running ConnectWise Automate version 11, 12, or later with the pre-installed .NET framework. For more information concerning the system requirements, please consult the technical documentation available on the Acronis website. In order to obtain the Acronis plugin, navigate to System, Solutions, Solution Center. Search for the Acronis Data Cloud plugin. The plugin installation is a standard process and doesn't require any special guidance. Once the plugin is installed, navigate to Systems, Solution, Plugin Manager. Press the Advanced button. Select Reload Plugins, then Reload DB Agent Plugins. Restart the database agent by pressing the Yes button. We recommend restarting also the Lab Tech Control Center itself to apply all the changes to both the database agent and the Acronis plugin. As your next step, you need to set up your Acronis Data Cloud Partner account with ConnectWise Automate. Thus, navigate to System, Configuration, Dashboard. Click on the Config tab and select Integration, Acronis Data Cloud, Integration Settings. Provide the URL of the Acronis Data Cloud as well as the login and password for your partner account. As an option, you can disable Ticket and Alert Integration if you don't want to get excessive information about backup issues automatically generated by the ConnectWise Automate. Press the Save button to save the changes. In order to check the connection with your Acronis Data Cloud Partner account, press the Test Connection button. Similarly, you can add multiple partner accounts to enable the connection to multiple data centers. As the next step, you need to set up an Acronis Data Cloud Customer account within the ConnectWise Automate. You can do it two ways. First, you can create a customer account from scratch directly in ConnectWise Automate user interface. Second, you can create a customer account in the Acronis Data Cloud Management Console and then set it up in the ConnectWise Automate user interface. Let's have a look at each of those scenarios. In order to create a customer account from scratch directly in ConnectWise Automate's user interface, 
Open the Control Center. Double click on the name of the desired client and navigate to tab Acronis Data Cloud. Select an appropriate Acronis Data Cloud partner to which the new customer will be assigned and provide the customer's name, email, login, and password. Specify a storage to be used for storing the customer's backups and language. Finally, you might want to specify the types of notifications to receive, for example, notifications about backup failures. Based on the good practices of our partners, we recommend disabling the option Backup Succeeded with Warnings to eliminate excessive warnings that are, in most case, false alarms. Press the Create button to complete the operation. Let's have a look at the second scenario now. When the customer's account is created in the Acronis Data Cloud Management Console and then set up in the ConnectWise Automate user interface. Thus, log into the Management Console and press the New button in the upper right uh, corner of the page. Select Customer. Specify the name, language, and mode of the new customer. Press the Next button to proceed to the next step. Enable all the relevant services for the new customer and press the Next button. For each service, specify the quotas and press the Next button. Finally, create an admin account for the new customer. Press the Done button to complete the operation. As the next step, you need to set up the new customer account in the ConnectWise Automate user interface. Thus, open the Control Center, Double-click on the name of the desired client and navigate to the tab Acronis Data Cloud. Select the appropriate Acronis Data Cloud partner and customer from the corresponding drop-down lists and provide the login and password for the customer account. Press the Connect button to complete this operation. Repeat the same procedure for each ConnectWise Automate client whose computers you intend to back up. That's it with the settings. See you in the next video.